You know one of the biggest rip-offs in the world? Flowers. They grow free all over the world, and yet we pay for them. And then they die. That seems strange. Flowers are one of the few things we buy, bring home, watch die, and we don't ask for our money back. Normally, we'd be screaming at a merchant over something like that. Hey, what kind of shit is this? Give me my money back. The fucking thing's keeled over right on the piano. The caterpillar does all the work, but the butterfly gets all the publicity. Tits always look better in a pink sweater. You know what you don't see enough of on television? A good parachute accident. It's kind of fun. Ask your dry cleaner if he can remove the stains from one pair of pants and put them in another. He should be able to do that for the same amount of money. While you're in there, ask him if he can remove semen from a wedding veil. That's the test of a really good dry cleaner. To me, fast food is when a cheetah eats an antelope. That's fast. Two men whose names you see a lot on air conditioner dials. Norm and Max. Who are they? Have you ever been kissing someone and one of you has a snot that's whistling? It takes your mind off the sex, you know, because it requires a three-step solution. First of all, you have to figure out whose nose it's in. Then you have to determine which nostril. Finally, someone has to dig in there and if not completely remove it, at least push it to one side so it doesn't whistle anymore. By the way, during all this activity, the man usually loses his heart on. A crumb is a great thing. If you break a crumb in half, you don't get two half crumbs, you get two crumbs. Doesn't that violate some law of physics? I think I am, therefore I am. I think. Have you ever noticed that when you're torturing a guy, after a while you get real tired and you don't know what to do to him next? Then you think of something and you sort of get your energy back. Any man with a small mustache wearing a bow tie and a loud vest is an asshole. A cat will blink when struck with a hammer. I think reception lines would be a lot more interesting if instead of shaking hands, people greeted each other with a kick in the groin. The reason the mainstream is thought of as a stream is because it's so shallow.